Often, when Turning Points for Children meets many of their kids, there is despair and fear where the joy of childhood ought to be. Too often, when the children arrive at their next foster home, they're carrying a shopping bag with all their worldly belongings, a couple pairs of clothes, a book, favorite toy, and what you realize is all their childhood memories are in that bag. One child was 14 and had been in so many different homes. When asked, who's your next of kin, he would always answer his city social worker because that was the only consistent person in his life. He was 14 and had been in different homes for 11 years, which means his life as a tiny commuter with a brown paper bag suitcase began at the age of three years old. Turning Points for Children's Family Finding Program gives kids the empowering childhoods they deserve. Their cutting-edge methods are the result of congressional hearings and state-of-the-art research. Lacking proper support systems, far too many foster children suffer in the worst ways. The statistics show most do not graduate from high school, become homeless or jailed, and there are profound drug dependency problems as well. They are broken, and they stay broken. The Turning Points for Children outreach changes all that, and their family finding program is the only one of its kind in Philadelphia. Their success rate is 98% in finding relatives or dear friends willing to take care of children in properly sustaining and genuinely loving ways. Knowing that fractured adults come from fractured childhoods, the energy behind Turning Points for Children's effective community outreach is unparalleled. They teach people to utilize all existing resources, leading the entire community to take better care of itself. Turning Points for Children creates and runs an array of programs, strengthening over 2,500 families and making life better for over 5,000 children every year. Turning Point's award-winning state-of-the-art programs include in-home protective services, the Parenting Collaborative, Family Finding, and Family Empowerment Services. They are also an affiliate of the pioneering and nationally respected Public Health Management Corporation. And the Food and Wellness Network offers a community-based food pantry and nutritional information for children of all ages. These services and others over the decades have saved the lives of tens of thousands of children. Philadelphia's history-making district attorney, Seth Williams, is a Turning Points for Children advocate and a success story. He says they made all the difference in his life. I go wherever they ask me to go to support the hard work of Turning Points for Children because I know the value uh, of what it meant to me and what it can mean for so many other uh, children here in Philadelphia. Jim Oram was a decorated Army Ranger and commander in Vietnam. He and his sister were adopted through Turning Points programs. Jim is also the president of the board of directors of Turning Points for Children, following in the footsteps of his mother, who also headed up the board. One person can only do so much, but every person does a little bit. The collective result can be good, and we have seen it with some of our graduates from our programs, and uh, we've had some just tremendous success stories. Another impressive Turning Points for Children alumni is Candace Schillingford, who went on to become an intern with the Time Out for Teens and Tots program. This comprehensive service has decades of demonstrated success, keeping young mothers in school, heading for higher education, and provides health support and parenting skills for teens and their children. Now a college graduate, Schillingford makes it very clear why she's so devoted to the group. When I first found out I was pregnant in high school, my grades slipped a lot. I didn't think I was going to graduate. Someone told me that I was able to graduate, and that was right after I started Time Out for Teens and Tots prenatal group. And I saw the girls that was there that was, that was like going through the same thing that I was going through. I'm sorry if I'm getting emotional. A lot of girls do want to succeed in life. They, I mean, I don't want to say a child is a, is a mistake, but they did make that mistake but they don't have that support to sit there and go past that mistake and they just stuck. And I feel as though that because of the group, I was able to improve and to, you know, to move on with my life and to, and to do better. And now that I can sit there and say that my mom and them is proud of me now. 
in their ever-expanding multifaceted community outreach, Turning Points for Children partnered with Pennsylvania State Senator Anthony Williams and the Philadelphia Kinship Care Committee to map out strategies to better inform grandparents and other caregivers about the resources available to them in their neighborhood. CBS 3 Eyewitness News. Well, Philadelphia students will benefit from a $15 million federal grant aimed at improving early education. More than 5,000 kindergartners in the district will receive support and funding over the next five years from participating groups. The program falls in line with the reform plan outlined by school superintendent Dr. William Height. Turning Points for Children Chief Executive Officer Mike Vogel said the multi-award winning developer of Families and Schools Together, Dr. Lynn McDonald, came in from England to attend the press conference Revered City Council Leader Janie Blackwell is one of the city's leading advocates for educational progress and social change. She was so impressed with the results of the FAST program, she felt compelled to attend the press conference and offer her support. Well, a special graduation program today for parents and children in North Philadelphia. This was a scene here at the Kenderton Elementary School. Moms and dads, along with their young students, officially graduated from the FAST program, FAST standing for Families and Schools Together. Turning Point staff and directors help parents and grandparents who are caregivers to children at risk. FAST really changed our lives together. Yes, they did help me a lot with me and her. Our families come from impoverished backgrounds, but their spirits aren't impoverished. They're, they're really rich. They're empowered families. They're families that are strengthened with stronger family skills and feel more involved and engaged in the success of their school. I want to be a teacher. Teacher. Veterinarian. Teacher. Studies show three out of six fast kids want to be teachers. Since I've been in this program, I get good grades. Are they better? Yep, way better. <laughs> When I went in there, I wasn't too sure. And by the second time I did go in, I had fun. I enjoyed my time with my daughter. And it even helped me make a decision of turning myself into a better person and going to college. Mm -hmm. So I'm finally finishing with a degree, and my daughter's happy as well. So she's Good. like, Good. great. So it, I believe it's a great experience All for right. her. Turning Points for Children puts genuine caring and documented progress back into childhood. Their staff is an enthusiastic family of dedicated children's and educational experts who care deeply about their community. Their cutting edge methods and research restore health and hope. Their highly successful mission of connecting communities with resources has a lasting effect from generation to generation, improving educational achievement and family relationships all along the way. <laughs>